My name is Francisco Chavez. Uh, I'm a psychologist and uh, I work in this organization called Teen Challenge for the last uh, 30 years. Teen Challenge is a, uh, an organization that starts in the United States in the end of the 60s and uh, is spread all over the world. For, uh, it's about another 20 countries. It's uh, helping drug addicts, people that are facing this problem with drug addictions or alcohol, whatever, and help them to deal with the problem in order to live a sober, autonomous and uh, free life. There's a, a long history and a strong connection between mental diseases with addictions. Mental health is something really sensitive lately and uh, it's a strong issue that needs to be addressed. Most of the times we are addressing the consequences, the behavior, what is seen, instead of going to the roots. It's what we do the machine. We have a popular camera. Okay, it's a diagnosis is maybe the length is not the right place, low battery or whatever, the replace battery solved. But people are people, not machines. It's not to be fixed. It's to be is to grow, to be developed, to help them to to develop this all our own potential. The, the biggest dangers we can face is being alone. Sometimes we are, uh, when we are under strong feelings, we tend to be blind. And we need to ask someone that don't feel exactly like we feel toward our situation. Someone outside of us has a different look, more realistic and can help us to overcome and see we need to be courage to be vulnerable and that is nobody likes to be vulnerable being vulnerable is not not doesn't mean being weak someone says in the past uh, there's no man is an island so we really need each other when someone overcomes uh, an addiction problem and start to work and regain his family it's not me, Francisco, or my team doing it. It's me plus Corky Yoga, uh, plus uh, different companies. When they donate something, they help us to fulfill our mission. That's a really important thing for each of our workers, and for me as a national leader, is make us feel we are not alone.